All right, so let's talk about footwear and specifically winter footwear. Um, these spikes are required by the railroad for you to have during inclement weather. You have to have them on, otherwise your train master will definitely do his best to get you fired. <laughs> um, so this is something that you want to have with you every time you go somewhere. The problem with these things is that they are so big and so clunky and they take up a ton of room in your bag. Um, and also, when I first got these, I didn't realize that there was a specific or an easier way to put them on. So I want to show you guys that now so that you're not struggling out there for you know, two or three shifts like I did until I found a conductor that was like, there's an easier way to do that. So a uh, couple of things, footwear. These are the Jigsaw Timberland Pros with a 90 degree heel. And they are waterproof as well um, with insoles. This is what you would wear on a standard daily basis. Get some insoles for yourself if you can. It makes them a lot more comfortable and it makes them fit better. Um, outside of that, you have to be able to put these boots into these covers. So you have a taller version here, and then you've got a shorter one. These take up way less room, but if you are in an area with inclement weather, such as snow, uh, your boots and your, your pants and everything else are gonna get soaked unless you've got waterproof things on. The snow will find a way to end up in these boots. Um, so they are these are more convenient for rain, in my opinion. If, they, if it's like slippy mud and you wanna have something to have go, uh, take these. But otherwise, these are really the ones you want. Unfortunately, these are humongous. Uh, and they take up like half of that bag. So a couple of things. Um, when you're traveling, take your sh your tennis shoes that you're gonna take with you to the hotel. And if you decide to take a pair, you don't have to. Um, put these in here um, before you put it into your bag for the day. Outside of that, when you're putting your boots on in here, put these particular boots into plastic bags. You'll find these with your crew packs when you're setting up for the train. Put these over your boots, they'll keep everything dry in here, and plastic into the rubber slips directly into the boot and you won't have to fight it for a half hour to get your foot in there. So these plastic bags are like gold, they aren't always in stock, so when you see them, you get as many of them as you can and shove them in your bag. Um, but again, put your boot into here and then into here and they'll slip right on and they'll come right off and your feet will stay dry. I know this sounds weird, but remember when you were a kid and your mom told you to put your shoes and uh, inside plastic bags before you, you wet or put your socks inside plastic bags before you went uh, out to play in the snow. This is why. Uh, it keeps everything in there dry. And then when you get back, if they're still in good condition, dry them out, wrap them up, throw them back in your bag. If they're crap, trash them and then look for another set when you get out. But this is the winter apparel. These are the tall ones. The short set, use what you feel more comfortable with. I like to go have dry feet. If my feet are wet, my shift is over. <laughs> so hope that helps, guys.